In this video, we're going to be looking at installing a PV cam camera into Nikon Elements. So an important first step is to check that our cameras are actually plugged in and running correctly. And we include in our driver set some very useful little utilities for this. The first one is called RS Config, and you can find it in the PV cam group in Start menu. And here we show how many cameras you have plugged in. In this case, I have two plugged in one that says 1394 and this represents a firewire camera so an evolved delta and the other one is a USB camera in this case a Prime 95B. If you don't see what you expect check all your connections and check your cameras are turned on. What we can do next is another utility in the PV cam folder PV cam test and this will show us an image from a camera in this case if we just hit start it'll run a snap so get a single image here of a ginkgo biloba slide or we can go to live to get a live preview and there we are so the cameras are running fine we can add them into elements so now we want to go back to the start menu to find our Nikon elements folder so what we want to do is modify the installation to make sure that our photometrics drivers are included in our Nikon Elements installation. Unless you haven't already installed Elements, in which case you can do this when you first install. So we want to modify this installation and now we click next until we reach our list of cameras. So here you want to go to Photometrics Q Imaging and select all the groups of cameras that you have or that you expect to use. Then you can set up the rest of your optical system, the other components that you have. In this case, we just have a manual microscope. So then you can finish the installation, or in my case, because I've not changed anything, I'm just going to click Cancel. And there we have it. So now we can run Elements. And we're using Photometrics drivers. And here we are inside Elements. So the first thing we can do is press the Live View button, but with this light level we don't actually have any image because there's no scaling applied to the image. So what we need to do is activate lookup tables, LUTs, and we do this by right clicking on some grey area at the right hand side and choosing visualization controls, LUTs, and that will bring up this menu. So here we enable the LUTs and then turn on auto scaling and here is our image. If you need any further assistance, don't hesitate to contact Photometrics or your local dealer.